Good morning everyone. Welcome to our morning inspiration. Friday, August 2nd, 2024. Our reading today comes to us from Proverbs chapter 13, reading verse 11. Wealth got it by vanity shall be diminished, but he that gather it by labor shall increase. Amen. We thank the Lord this morning for this portion of his words and what the text is saying to us this morning is that those who acquire wealth by reason of vain practices the scripture is saying that they will lose it just as fast as they acquired it so it is important for us to understand that while we seek to better ourselves and while we seek to to grow financially that we must do it in the right way we must do it in a noble way so as the scripture say we must labor for that wealth and laboring for the wealth doesn't mean that you take advantage of other people. But you must work honestly, not deceitfully. You must not cheat and take advantage of others in order to acquire wealth. Because if you do that, and if the reason for your acquiring wealth is vain if it is for selfish reason if the reason that you are acquiring this wealth is just to serve your own purpose and interest then you will lose it just as fast as you get it because we must understand that when god bless he doesn't bless us so that we can keep it to ourselves he expects us to share that blessing with those around us. And so Solomon here is a great example in the fact that he was a wealthy person. And so he has insight on what it means to live an empty life. And you having a lot of wealth. It doesn't mean that you are wealthy right because for you to experience or to enjoy the wealth that you have you have to live a life of purpose and how do you live a life of purpose is by surrendering your will to Christ so whatever we do in our pursuit to be financially stable or to have possessions we must make sure that God is at the center of it all because if we do it for any reason except that of of what God intends and if we do it for only selfish reason then the Lord is going to allow us to lose it or he's going to take it away. So, you ever heard the saying, as fast as it comes, it left in the same speed. Because what? Our heart is empty, vain. And as scripture tells us that vanity, vanity of vanities is what it is. And so may we continue to trust God to help us to manage our wealth and to live and to work honestly and to develop the right principles in doing that which is right in the sight of God. Amen.